What's up everyone, it's Annie Tier. Just giving a little quick update to my Patreons, shoutouts, and just overall what's going on at the moment with, uh, you know, on my Patreon. We got a lot of good stuff. If you check on one corner of the screen, you'll be able to see what's been going on while at the same time what's going to happen in the next few days. But anyway, let's just get to the shoutout. For the first is Alexander Kranev. Next is Christopher Wagner. Cody Fox, Disciple, D Max D Master XD, Ishinglin, NZ, NZ for short, In Need of Church, Crakes, Crakes, yeah I think I said that right, Lusmo or Lukmo, Pastel, and Typhlosion Productions. So I just wanted to give a quick shout out for those of you that decide to still to be still to this day remain as Patreons. I appreciate all of you. Thank you for the support. And as always, look forward to more content here on YouTube and more so on Patreon. For more information regarding why I'm only uploading, I guess you can say just one episode a day, I'll explain it more on my Discord or in a YouTube video sooner than later. But anyway, let's just get to the video. Hopefully you enjoy the review, and yeah, whatever the redirect is for the reaction I'm reacting to. But yeah, that's it, guys. See you in the review. Peace. What is up guys, Annie Tier Guild Forever, going to reviewing SAO Episode 12 War on Underworld. I think that's the proper title. You'll see when I upload it to YouTube. So it's basically that was the last episode, but that was on such a cliffhanger. We didn't get to see the rest of the SAO players come into this. I'm assuming they're coming. I'm pretty sure they are. And yeah, that's that's nowhere near the end. We're basically we like first of all. Kirito hasn't woken up. Alice has been abducted. This guy, he calls himself the Dark Knight, but apparently he has a good account. But what is he going to do? Like, what is this guy doing? Toward the end of the credits, it shows him walking through a hallway. Did he found them? The ones that are going into the dive? Let me know, because, like... The way it ended, like, there, what was it suggesting? I feel like it was trying to convey something... But I didn't catch on or I didn't understand what it was trying to capture. But yeah, um, hopefully someone can explain that. But if it's spoiler territory, do not tell me. I'll figure out for myself. <coughs> but still, that, so that's basically it. I just wanted to do this episode because, well, I mean... Dude, like, I, I've, been, I've been like... This should have been done a long time ago, but I'm sorry. I just... I completely forgot that I had another episode for SAO War on Underworld. I was pretty certain I caught I'm I was caught up completely. But no. And when I mean caught up, I'm talking about anime wise. We're not counting the light novel or visual novel or whatever kind of no novel. I, I ain't interested in seeing a novel, okay? So yeah. But uh, overall it looks like um Veto already has Alice captured. The point, what I'm trying to realize is where is he going with her? What is he trying to do right now? I know the point is to bring her back, bring her back with them, but like, dude, like, where are you going? Like, what are you trying to do? I don't see what he's planning to do, but he better make it fast. It looks like Shino came into the picture to freaking help out, but hey, as good as Shino is. That's not going to be enough to take all those players down. They're going to need every pro player from Elfheim. They get them in. They're good to go. <coughs> so I'm really hoping they come through in like the next part. Whenever it decides to drop. Because I'm pretty sure like when did, are they going to announce the next part to season 3 of SAO. Because um... We still don't know. I mean, I know a lot of the things in the world are being delayed because of, you know. But uh, I'm just curious on, like, when are we going to get it? Because I really, really, really want to see the next uh, arc for SAO. But I I don't know. Like, all, they, all, they, all I know is it, there's a 
there's a preview out. I already saw it. I don't know anything else based outside of the preview, but I'm just... I don't know. I think the preview is suggesting that Kirito is going to come back. I don't know. Again, I can't wait until my boy snaps out of his out of his dilemma. I know what he's into right now is not entirely his fault. I'm just very, very curious on when it's going to happen because I really want to see him snap out of this already so I can see him whooping some ass like always. But still, overall, it's great. Love it. Can't wait to see what happens next. And, um, yeah, overall, um, I mean, I still retain pretty much most of my knowledge of where I left off. I just wish there was more to see, you know? Like, there wasn't a whole lot. Like, it didn't really end on a point that tells you, like, okay, this is the stopping point. See you guys in the next... It's kind of like, okay, we're watching, we're watching. Bam! Random interruption, and that's it. You gotta wait for part two. Man... How long do I gotta wait for part two, man? I really wanna see the next part. Hopefully it's not gonna be long. I feel like toward the end of this year, maybe, or sometime early next year. Unless they already announced it. If they already did, just tell me when it's going to come out. That way I know and I'm prepared for it. Um, but uh, I'm just gonna leave it at that once again. Um, it's a fairly quick episode and um, just wanted to get that out of the way really liked it if there's anything you want to discuss with me regarding SAO leave it in the comment section below I'd be more than happy to discuss it with you guys in the comment section below other than that that's pretty much it until the next video tomorrow see you guys till then peace